on no ears. Well, no ears on the most beautiful woman in the world. Without further ado, let me introduce you to her. Her name is Miss Archie. Gracias, Hello, Hello, everybody. How nice to see you again and again. And we've just seen off camera a lovely lady by the name of Marie. All the way from downtown in Glasgow. Glasgow, Glasgow, she said. But Glasgow is the same. Well, that's how they say it. Ah, this is how That's they how they say it. it, yeah. And she's staying at the M Boutique Hotel based on our review. And she says it's absolutely amazing. But it is really nice hotel. It's new and it's all fresh, so why not? And I'm glad that Marie enjoyed the stay in Paris. Yeah, and we do thank her very, very much for coming up and saying a big, big hello and for thanking us. And we do appreciate every single person that writes a comment. And if you do see us, why not come up and say a big, big hello. We will not bite, that's for sure. Or perhaps if you don't want to be on camera, just wait a couple of minutes or follow us, stalk us, as one or two people like to do. And we do enjoy to meet each and every one of you that has watched us on the little platform known as YouTube. We're on the downtown Cater Papas Promenade and we're in the first week of November, or actually into the second week, if you are curious by the way. And of course the weather is absolutely incredible. So if you are looking for somewhere for that last bit of winter sun, yeah, we're up there with the top countries in the world. 28 degrees, everything's looking blue, the sky is blue, Mr. Paul is dressed heads of blue, the sea is blue. All that's missing is... Because you, you are the dearest members of family. So you have to get on the big bird or we can win stuck paddling like crazy. That's because we all... Yes, Lord Julian, don't break your screen, please, because otherwise you have to buy the new TV. We all unpatiently waiting just for you. We are indeed on the downtown Ketapapos promenade. And for those of you who follow the channel and watch the last little episode, you understand that slowly but surely the Marika and Me Land Bar is going to come online and it will be open guaranteed for the 15th of March 2025 and of course a lot of people are flying in for the event and we do thank them very very much indeed and also a big big thank you to the people that are helping to fund it. Dayman goes without question, thank you very very much indeed. Lord Andy and of course his very own beauty, that's our girl and of course his girl. Lady Ness. If your name is Baron Von Cigar and you just happen to have the hand of the greatest, greatest accountant in the world, Lady Victoria, we thank you. If your name is Lady Kerry and of course you've got a rock standing right by you, that's ours and your Lord Tony. We thank you very, very much for the funds that you are gifting us either by bank transfer or of course on PayPal. And if you would like to get on that wall of fame and get a sir or a lord or a lady or a baron before your name and let the world know that you helped to fund the Marika and Me a Lounge Bar. Why not go hunt us down on PayPal? Paul G. Cyprus, P-A-U-L-G-E-E, -E, Cyprus. And up will come that little smiley face of the most beautiful woman in the world and myself as we thank you very, very much indeed for your contribution. And if you'd like to buy a brick, 50 pounds a brick is all it will cost you. And we do thank you from the bottom of our two hearts. And I can't imagine how nicely people sit in around these areas. And of course, the front line to the sea, it's more attractive. But I don't think our place will be less attractive because all we will try to bring to it a spotlessly shiny, beautiful atmosphere with a lovely meeting and greeting you all. And all we're gonna have is just not very high prices for you to enjoy the sitting because we don't want to over charge you. That is the right word, is it? Well, that's the right word. We will be charging the same prices as all of the bars in and around us. So basically that's around three euros fifty for a pint of Leon. If you want a pint of Guinness, perhaps if you're in downtown playing Gotham, and of course your name is Sir of the Michael of the Crompton. Yep, 450 for one of those 
smooth cans of Guinness or perhaps a can of Murphy, those kind of things. Of course, we'll have some expensive tots if your name is Lord Ronaldo, perhaps you fancy that cognac, and of course, his French beauty fancies a little bit of rum, perhaps she fancies cognac. cognac. How do you say Armagnac. it? Armagnac. Uh, this is kind of uh, one which is actually very, very nice. And as I all, we all should know, we all should know that that dearest cognac should be brought, whether with a warm glass or there is kind of stand. There is nothing very uh, difficult, by the way, to serve it like that. It's just a simple thing that makes a huge difference to the service and you just make understand your customer should I call like this that you're aware how the every certain uh, drink should be served well we cannot do do it uh, warm glasses with the beers pint of beers should be other way around brought with the cold glasses if anything I will try to refrose them or to bring the special uh, covers, no, the chillers. chillers underneath, which will help to eat, uh, you know, because in the summertime when you get the pint and it's so easy to go warm, then person have to be our dearest mart to drink it within a second. <laughs> not everybody can, sorry my dearest mart, but not everybody can drink it. You know, not everyone, no. A lot of people like to take their time, perhaps, if your name is Sir Jim, our surfboard kid. And of course, I'm pretty sure if she's watching, she's lighting up like a Christmas tree. His PM and of course, our girl, Lady Paula Marie. And he is actually manufacturing some beer mats for us. And they're going to be in plastic and of course, branded as Marika and me. And of course, there'll be lots of merchandise for sale in the Marika Me Lounge bar as well, from t-shirts to beer mats, to patches, to hats, to sunglasses. And of course, Marika will have her little boutique and that will be to raise funds for two various charities in and around downtown Kitto Papos. No, that will be a really great idea for the people to, to buy a, a clothes or whatever we will be introducing to them if only they want to help and of course as you understand the prices of the clothing will not be expensive at all uh, that's because it that's because it's called charity and the charity needs to be done in a very charity way it does indeed this is the end of the downtown Kedapapas promenade by the way that's the harbour restaurant which means we're about to enter the harbour Right over the road is a nice big, totally free of charge car park, and there is a further free of charge car park to the rear of the harbour restaurants. So don't click off just yet, because we're en route to the downtown Cato Papos Harbour, the main event. This is where more people come and sup on a pint, or perhaps a chill drink or two in the Cato Papos promenade and harbour area than anywhere else. Well, except for the Marika Me Lounge Bar, of course, which will be open on the 15th of March, 2025. Now, word of warning, if you are a smoker, not that you should be, but if you are, perhaps if your name is Sir Daniel, and he's got a girl's life who's always, always right, and we'd like to say a massive, massive congratulations to Lady Sherry, because she has welcomed a new grandson. So, fabulous, fabulous news and hopefully you'll keep us updated and send us the odd picture or two. And on that note, talking about grandsons, I want to say a big, big shout out to Lady Zena and of course our Sir Cam and of course their little prince, Prince Lorenzo. We're looking forward to seeing you when you come with your grandmother and your mum and your dad to the wedding of a lifetime in downtown Kedapapos next September because that's when Zena and Cam are going to tie the knot and we've been invited to make one of our little videos so you'll be able to watch it on YouTube. You know through this YouTube we met so many lovely people all our family members becoming bigger and bigger and the best for me is that they make friends with each other now and they communicate with each other without us which is lovely isn't it not lovely when people 
could never met. Even they uh, they lived uh, on the next street, uh, like a neighbors, and they never knew each other. So, but through our channel, they become friends. Which is it is indeed, and a big shout out to a girl in downtown Damp, South Wales. She likes a little bit of brightness in her life. She's already found the man of the dreams. Of course, that's Lord of the Jace. What's her name? Our girl, Lady Whitney. And hopefully they've managed to schedule meeting up with those two naughty, naughty boys from downtown Damp and Dreary Cardiff. That's Baron Jeremy and of course Baron Simon. And rumour has it that they are going to get on a big bird in about a week or so and jet into downtown Cato Pathos and we're looking forward to it. And so is Miss Oching Priscilla Booth because she's looking forward to that visit to the King's Avenue Mall. I will never forget how I, when I was in Georgia these two boys were coming out of their bushes like two teddy bears. Do that again. Doing something like that. They were coming out of the bushes, right? What I, exactly what I've shown you now. And over those bushes, the bushes were more, not, not carted gently like now. Uh, they were huge and I couldn't, you couldn't see them coming out. But Paul was filming them and they were just pretending to be somebody I am not sure anyway they were coming out of these bushes but you should have seen the rehearsal when they were getting into the bush there was really? an awful lot of uh, well effort and jeffing as the twigs were going into various parts of their anatomy and I just said to them get in that bush and get they did in, get in that bush this is how it was yeah that's how it Lovely. was. It was very funny. Guys. A moment captured on camera for the rest of our lives. And this, video. and you've got that little clip. Yeah, yeah. this is the downtown Cape Town Harbour area, by the way. King's Restaurant. That's where we're going to find us quite often if we're not up renovating the Marie Claude Lounge Bar. We're going to go and sit down now and have a nice little can of Coke, and probably the sort of who is going to have a beer or something like that. So we're going to say thanks for watching. If you like what you see, please don't forget to hit the like, smash that subscribe. Please don't forget to keep the channel afloat. Here she is, Princess Nina, and there is the wannabe a gangster known as Andreas. Barring me. Yeah, barring me. That's the new channel. You're right, Kamara? I like it. Yeah, good. Don't forget to subscribe and put the like and the bell notifications. They're amazing people. And really the new good channel, people. Bar me. What you see on the videos, this is a, they are true selves. They are very good people. Absolute star. Absolute star. Andreas is a legend in downtown Kedapapos. He started off here as a very, very small boy, twiddling his feet in the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. And then his mom said, Come on, I got a job for you at King's Restaurant. And he's been here for the rest of his life. Thanks for watching. I haven't seen Xenia for a long time, but now I'm going to have a good talk or two. Thank you, our dearest members of family and our dearest guests of the channel for coming and staying with us, for watching us. Please don't forget to come and see another of our madnesses. Many kisses and bye-bye. Thanks for watching. Of course, we'll enjoy your company again very, very soon indeed.